Brenda always has a song in her head. Sometimes it's the last thing she hears, and sometimes it's a song she hasn't heard in years that just pops into her head. She loves to figure out how to play these random songs on the flute. She practices for hours, always trying to learn these new tunes. And when she learns them, she plays them over and over until another song pops into her head that she can learn, and the process begins again. One day, a melody Brenda doesn't recognize at all creeps into her head. Do, 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 do. Despite not knowing where it came from, Brenda eagerly learns to play it on the flute. She plays the song for her mother, but she doesn't recognize it. She plays it for her friends, but they've never heard it either. Brenda can't figure out where the song came from, but the tune stays stuck in her head. Do, 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 do. At first, Brenda likes it. It makes her feel special, like she has her own personal theme song. But unlike the other songs that pop into her head, this one never goes away. The song is loudest when it's quiet. Do, 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 do. Brenda is exhausted from not getting enough sleep because the song won't leave her alone. She tries to play another song, any other song, but she can't. Brenda's mom tells her it sounds like she has an earworm. Ew, Brenda responds. I have a worm? Brenda's mom tells her it's not an actual worm. It's just what you say when you have a catchy song stuck in your head. It should go away on its own in a day or two. But it doesn't. The tune stays with her for weeks, always playing in her head. Do, 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 do. Soon, Brenda feels like the song is a part of her, like an arm or a leg, a never-ending soundtrack. Then one day, it is gone. The earworm has finally left her head. Brenda is relieved. In fact, she can't even remember how the tune goes. She tries to play the first few notes on her flute, but she doesn't know where to start. Brenda tries playing a different song she used to enjoy practicing, but she can't play that song either. There are no songs in her head at all, just silence. Brenda has become so used to hearing the earworm that it has left her brain void of all music. She plays every note on the flute, but nothing sounds familiar. Brenda starts to miss her theme song. It feels like a piece of her is missing. Every other sound now feels so loud and noisy. She tries and tries to remember the tune, but she has no idea how the song goes. Then, she hears it. Do, 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 do. But this time, the song isn't coming from her head. It's coming from another room. Do, 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 do. Brenda follows the faint sound. It grows louder and louder with every step. Do, 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 do. She follows the sound into her bedroom, where she finds it. A tiny, slimy worm crawling around humming her song. Do, 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 do. Brenda can't believe it. The earworm is real. Brenda isn't sure what to do, but she does know that she never wants to lose her song again. She picks up the humming worm, tilts her head and lets the worm crawl into her ear. Brenda's head fills with the earworm's song once again. Her song. Do, 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 do. Brenda picks up her flute and plays the tune. In fact, she never plays another song again.